has returned. Me! If you don't know who me is, then... Thank you for that beautiful interruption. Now, which one was I? I haven't done this in a long time. About eight months to be exact. Which is more than half a year. Which is obviously something saying something very good about my Let's Plays. Very, very good. I'm probably sure a bunch of you thought I forgot about you guys. Well, I didn't. But, I'm lost and I don't know what I'm doing. I'm gonna check the star map thing. So, I'm the flight ship. I am the flight ship. And I felt I needed to finally update something. Because... I didn't have the time, and we're gonna go back to Sumar Galaxy, and uh, just a, such a great galaxy. I mean, it's, such, it's, a, it's a great game. And, in case you're wondering, I know a lot about Sumar Galaxy. So yeah, the playlist probably looks like a mess. I'm gonna keep it that way because I'm too lazy to, to change anything. But what I'm also gonna do it is, is the sound alright? I, I hope I hope the sound alright. But what I'm also gonna do is I'm also gonna and then walk my words. I'm going. I'm going to. I'm gonna try to be better at this. But anyway. Last time I went to the Ghost of the Galaxy. I didn't update I didn't update that video, so Um I accidentally did this off screen because I probably deleted the video where I actually did this on film. But I rescued Luigi. Long story short, I rescued Luigi and did the secret star. Oh. Right. Now it's time for very spooky sprints. Also there is a formula for how this is done. Let's skip all this. Hi Toad. Hi Toad. Captain Toad. The Brigade members haven't come back. What are they up to? I don't know. They're probably not being smart. At all. Oh, if you're wondering. Oh my god, he's already invincible! That's the secret level. I already did that. So if you actually want to watch that, go check out somebody who wants play who's better than me. And probably popular. The bridge is missing this time. It was there last time. There was a bridge last time. I feel like I really should do it in the other parts again, but I'm not gonna too much time. To me. Anyway, Boo Guy. Oh yeah, so as I was talking- Yee hee hee, so we have after two- Nah, fine. Sure, let's wing it. <laughs> here we go. So, this is a full star race. This planet- Oh, and note to self, that planet's gravity is humongous. If you, if you get hit from here, you will literally get knocked back to that planet. The key to this is just grabbing fast and not dying and not getting behind because if you do then that's disastrous for you because that guy for some annoying reason um I'm failing well you could skip ahead if you're smart and then what I usually do here is fail anyway Oh yeah, these things have gravity, which is good to know if you're gonna try to let's play this. Or just play it, you know, like normal people do. But anyway, that plant's- anyway. Whoa, that's so hard. <laughs> it's actually a lot harder in- it's much a lot harder, I just had practice. 
Because I'm good at this game. Totally not lying here. And uh, I've noticed something. My voice doesn't sound very good on videos. And it sort of sounds like I'm a beginner and don't know what I'm doing. Which is true, because I'm a beginner and don't know what I'm doing. But, and I keep getting off topic and not talking about what I want to talk about. And I didn't know commentary was so hard. Oh wait, we can listen to this story now. I'm gonna add the chapters, I'm gonna read the story to you guys. Maybe I should read it later. No, I'm gonna read it to you, was it? I like the suspense, of, like, it's like Paper, I like, it's like Super Brave Mario with the story behind it. Except, it's not really that, it's option, except the story is optional and sort of meh. Where to begin? Repeating what she said. I like this music. Chapter 5, Home. The kitchen will go go here, and the library will go over there, the girl said busily to herself. We'll put the gate here. Ever since the girl took Luma under her care, she'd been bustling about at a feverish pace. It's a lot of work, but it's worth it to make a happy home. It turned out the starbirds weren't the only things buried in the ice. There were tools and furniture, unlike any they had ever seen, and the girl used them to build a home. That makes sense. Remember, comets have random tools and furnitures in them. That's a scientific fact. Looking at the completed house, Luna, rem Luna remarked, Don't you think that's awfully big for just the two of us? With a library, bedroom, kitchen, fountain, and gate. Yes, those are all domes inside the comet observatory. It was certainly spacious, but still something seemed to be missing. Yes, you need an engine room so you can man the engine. And I'm just... And I forgot to, spoil, to say spoiler alerts here. Spoiler alert! Even though this is a let's play, so you're already spoiling it for yourself by watching this. Well, maybe you want to see. Maybe you want to. If only my fa father. Wait, story break. If only my father, brother, and mother were here, Thor said wistfully. Indeed, the house is too large for its too small residence. So. Maybe you, maybe just spoil word word because they don't want want to know what happens at the end of this let's play till the end of the let's play. So, spoil word for the let's play. There's an engine room. And there's also a hidden room, dome, which dome room that I'm not telling you about. That night, clutching her favorite, and it's not, and it wasn't named. Clutching her favorite stuffed bunny close to her heart, the girl fell asleep in the starship. Which happens to be, I think, like, one of the star streams. That should do it for today. And, yeah, you can just reread them by pressing A on the read book. That was chapter 5. Anyway. Oh, yes. These levels, they work in a certain way. I'll show you. When I get back. Well, there are two kinds of... There are three kinds of level. A Bowser level, which has one grand star. A... Uh, um, one thing level, which has a star, and only a star. Alright. Flying to the galaxy. There's a one thing level, which has one star and only one star. It only has one star, so. Alright, which has one star. And then there's the regular levels, which have six. Each. Square Poltergeist. You know, Poltergeist, Poltergeist. Puns. But the uh, thing is, the green stars are added onto these galaxies. So like, uh, so like there is, so the other two, the other two green stars are in regular galaxies. So that makes it so some galaxies, so two galaxies in this game have a, have seven stars in them. That's something you don't get to see in. Luigi was kidnapped by the monster that was over there. Didn't we already rescue Luigi? Oh wait, I rescued Luigi. You weren't there. Also, look at this long jump. Just going. I think I launched myself into uh into orbit. That's fun. But let's go into the slot star now. So, oh, well, there's a format, and the green stars actually add completely on. So there's a one star level. And when you get the green star, then you 
said if you get the green star, then that tell you that's how you get it. And it will show a green question mark as a green hidden level. Wait, so like, what? And it will show the question. It will show the whole. It's a hidden level question mark star at the beginning, but it will show it in green. And this confuses some people because one of them is being held by Luigi. And the people think green for Luigi. Well, no, it's green for Green Star, alright? Because the other two Luigi levels don't have it, so. Yeah, I want to get that straight. Anyway. So, there's only one chomp at the beginning of the bridge. Always. Bomb booze. They're black. We're going to be dead for bombs. Oh, this is a perfect opportunity to tell you my theory. Warning. This theory may be scary. 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 And, alright, do not criticize me for how unrealistic it is. Because my job here is to make unrealistic theories. It's not fun to make realistic theories that have actual evidence. Well, that's what it is. That's why I watch game series. But... I don't know how to make, I don't know, I don't know what evidence is. Oh, I know, yeah, I do. But, anyway, I do have a theory. It may not sound like much, but, and I don't think it's much to spin bomb moves. I already know that, but, also, if you fall down here, you will not die. You'll have to get something. I thought you'd die. So, what I found, um, what I found is, I am so good at this game, so good at this game, and don't comment about that. I just made somebody comment about that now, didn't I? Oh well. Anyway, so, don't criticize me for being nonsensical. Now, since we're at the ghost level, and we're not going to be coming back to it for some time, I want to tell you the theory now, and we'll talk about the levels thing later. I gotta stay on con on topic more, though. There is a way to, as you can see, that actually does get them spinning next to them. In case anybody looks like wondering. I know a lot of Mario stuff, like trivia, I guess you'd call it. Like, you don't have to have to, like, I think the whole reason those things are there is so you can do this. But then you can just get them with your hands, so I bet nobody else knows that. Except people who are actual with their glitches. It's not anyone in my team. So, one of the things, well, I got a theory. So, any of you... I watched Doctor Who, which I have never watched because it's scary. No comments about me being scared of cat. It's just scary. And I whispered something that you couldn't hear on purpose. Which will get me comments. That's my master plan. I'm gonna get comments by making stuff that people can't hear. It's genius! That's weird. Anyway, sometimes it's amazing the stuff I can come up with. I'm trying to what my plans are, but anyway, posters. Posters? I don't know why, but I want to call them posters. Alright, so, because I'm gonna be cool, boom. As I was saying, boom. So, any of you have watched Doctor Who? But I've never watched, just for reasons I will not say in this video. Alright. I don't like this concept. To block, it's the only reason this plant is here to block you. Wow, I am failing. Wait, am I actually gonna, alright, there. So, 
the whole. Whoa, this is a cool ga galaxy. And whoa, there's blocks in the. I forgot about this one. This one's pretty nice. That, that plant's pretty nice. But now I'm just gonna go to the boss there. So I'm running out of time to talk about this. Well, you know about the weeping angels. Not a little fun fact about the weeping angels. I don't need the life room, but no. I want to conserve my servants. So I have to do the checkpoint there. So if I die, it'll be fine. And a, and I would get a one up, but it just but I, but this is the only time we're going to be playing it tonight, and it resets your one up. So I don't see why I need it. This one's not that hard. But you know the weeping angels. Here's a little trivia on them. My mom is afraid of them. That's actual trivia, not some random fact about my. It's white chip trivia. Not actual Weeping Angel trivia, that would be too- I'd have to look for that. And as we all know, I have an entirely amazing attention span of 10 seconds. I've been improving. It used to be 5. Actually, it used to be 7, and then it used to be 5. I'm improving slowly, but unsurely. This- if you're wondering why I'm saying all these things about myself, it's called being modest. I'm pretty sure that's not how you be modest, but... I was like, notice this time, the music. I've got all the time in the world. Oh boy. Yeah, I don't think he goes anywhere. So, you have to do this, guess how many times? If you guess three, you're incorrect, cause for some reason it's two. Makes sense. Follows the classic Mario formula of it, 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 it's unique, cause it's three, but not that unique, cause it's still the same concept over and over. You can hurt the hands, I guess. So I guess it's counting as three because the hands are a your life, but you don't have to. Because when it's attacking, the it leaves the body open. Or if you just real, or if you just get really close to it, it's open anyway. Plus he re plus he regenerates the hand, so you try try to go for the body. I'm just failing at it right now. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Have you ever noticed those black parts are actually sky? Back to the. Weeping angels, alright? So look, now he's open. Now's the time to get him. But I am not. Maybe I should stop commentating. Maybe that's it. Waving on the commentary is what I've always been told as a kid. Boom! Got a second hit on him, finally. That's when he's supposed to attack. Sometimes if you get really close to him, you can just cheat it by just like getting really close to him. Oh, so when he does the rock thing, he, you did, you're not even giving me any more. Come on. So what you gotta do? So like, oh my goodness, this is a train wreck. I destroyed the bamboo with another bamboo. That's definitely what I needed to do. No doubt about it. I didn't need to actually hit the bad boss thing. The bad boss thing. I should get a Nobel naming award thing from like PPD or something. I'm gonna call him and have him. Even though I have no relation to him at all, I'm a random stranger to him. I should call him and ask him for a Nobel naming award. I make so much sense. But anyway, weeping angels. I've, I think that the boos are obviously something dead. I think they're dead weeping angels. Now before you go, but fly Jim, that's ridiculous. Wait, wait, what is it? I always think I hear a timer during that section, which makes me think he'll go back. All right, I always think I hear a timer during that section. But anyway. I call him um, weeping 
I think that they are weeping angels because number one, they st they don't move when you look at them. Number two, um, actual trivia about the weeping angels: they cover their eyes so they avoid looking at each other and freezing both of them at the same time. And as you can see, when you look at a boo, it covers its eyes. And sec, all right. So I think that maybe they just base Nintendo just base the enemies off them. But that's all my evidence except for one more thing. Which is where I really think this hits the spot. Hmm. Alright, this is... Uh, this piece of evidence is... This piece of evidence, it sort of... Uh, oh, the music now changed. This piece of evidence, just to listen to this. Alright, no, it's really not that good. But in Luigi's Mansion, the game all about the ghosts and the booze sinking the airships. Luigi's Mansion, in the gallery of uh, the, in the gallery of EGAD's, in the EGAD's gallery, in the, in the game focused around booze, is, hey, can I get to that airship? Nope. But, in the gallery about the, in the game about the, so a reference in a game about the booze is in the gallery there is a, a statue. There are two statues, to be in fact, of angels in the gallery of Egad's lab. <laughs> in the Egad gallery thing. Alright. Give me give me give me coin. Oh come on! So, yeah, I just find that sort of freaky-ish. So, yeah. I have so much evidence. I make my themes with so much evidence it makes you cry. With sadness, because there's no actual evidence. Wait, I got to the flagpole. Why is the level not ending? Oh. More following the classic Mario format, like it should. That's way, that's a long way to say that, that all Mario games should follow the classic format. Especially when I really enjoy things that don't, like Super Paper Mario. Which sort of does a lot more than the other Paper Mario games, like Thousand Year Door. So, yeah. But I've never played Thousand Year Door. I played Paper Mario the original. That was Thousand Year Door, though. <coughs> Commentary wears me down, so I'm gonna try to buy something from him. And then realize I don't have enough star bits, because I'm not collecting them as much as I should be. So, ah, uh, the fearless, with parentheses, Captain Toad. Boy, you finally made it, I'm starting to worry. Wait, you're finally here. Oh, man. As you can see, we can see obvious signs in this game that Captain Toad is, he is super brave and fearless. Anyway, yeah, this is his fourth, this is the, this is the first of four games that, he, that he's appeared in, and I always liked him. Of course, there's the second Mario Galaxy game, the Super Mario 3D World, and, of course, his own little Captain Toad game, which I own, and could be playing right now, instead of continuing on to the, on with this failed series, but I'm not going to. I don't remember it being this fast. Oh, it wasn't that fast. I thought like it was so fast that like Mario was being pushed up against it. I'm like, oh wait, no, it's a lover. I still don't remember it being that fast. That coin was super useful how it fell. I love how these things were. Already at the boss battle. See. There's a shorter, there's a short little thing before the boss battle. In the first boss fight, that short little, before, between, before the Bowser Jr. battles, there's a short little thing, I'm gonna call it, because I don't know what else to call it. A, like, little short excerpt thing. And it gets short and excerpt -y. Well, it's a short thing. Like a little short, like little mini level before you actually go. That's like a, like one planet long. 
Yeah, it's, it's a, yeah, for the Bowser Jr. fight, it's a one planet long, like, mini level, as you can see with that one airship before it. The first one was just a planet, and the second one was that airship. The third one, the third one's gonna be a sequel. Remember that feeling it's done sequel? Well, I had more, well, I had actual planned sequels planned, so, trust me, you will see that. And I will probably die. He's angry. <laughs> because if you couldn't tell, besides the fact that it's the third hit, so it makes sense that he's angry, they also need to make him steaming mad, make an entire cutscene about it, and make Bowser shoot fireballs at him. Sometimes I think they over exaggerate. Going, 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 go. Mine, 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 mine. Alright. The only one. Now, this actually starts a new place of the level. There's a different way to hurt him. No, just kidding. Well, but, it's the same way to hurt him as usual. Come on. Let me, let me get you. Money. Money makes the world go round. Cause if it didn't, I would be broke. And the world would no longer be spinning. And, I, the money makes the world go round. And I'm broke, so the world stops spinning. Oh no. That's why it's night. Because it stopped during night. Oh, come on. As you can see, the, how good I am at this game is apparent. I am super good at this game. As I'm sure everybody here can see. I don't any of you start trying to say that I am not as good at this game. I'm just commentating. Because if I blame it on commentating, people won't yell angry comments at me. Except they will. Alright. Okay, it takes four hits to hit him. Man, people are sure creative. creative. I'll call this episode Creativity. Because I was creative about a... Because they were creative about how many hits enemies take. And I was creative... About, about my theories, my game theories. I'm gonna put a link to the game theory in the description. And maybe on screen here. Yay! Anyway, the power star. I'm not sure if I would have mentioned this. In fact, the only reason I know is because I watched it in a video. But each time you get a grand star, you get a new musical instrument. So, that was the return of the flight ship. I just ran the, I just, without really realizing it, I just, without really re realizing it, beat, I realized that without really, there's a new galaxy, people, so that's a new galaxy. So, I realized that I nonchalantly, just meet Bowser Jr. in a boss battle with the Grand Star, not making any big deal about it. I need to look up the dramaticness on this channel. Thanks to your friends, your friends, all of the domes of the lower level is are working again. Once the edge of room on the upper level has power, the whole observatory will be working again. The Comet Observatory will be flying as a starship again. See, this game already spoils the edge room for you. I don't need to spoil it for you. And you'll be able to head to this fly to your special one in the center of the universe. Special one. You could ask me her her you could ask me her name. But no, it's the special one. Yes! So now we're gonna go to the bedroom. And by now I mean next time because it's been about 30 minutes if I'm not cutting anything out, which I probably won't. Because my commentary is important-ish. Well, goodbye. So long. Farewell. Miyamara. I just randomly said something that sounded Spanish. You don't think I know what I'm doing. Because I don't. And now, one last fail at stunts. Why does it have to go... This is the worst possible angle for it to have when I'm trying to do stunts. A uh, uh, finishing stunt. If I... Stunt. If I get up there, 
when I get up there, I will say goodbye. We're gonna, right, aka, I'm just gonna show you how many, never mind, I'm not gonna cut that out, I turn it in two dies. Bye guys! Don't, don't, turn off the,